To some, it is the toughest estate in the West Country. To others, though, it is home and a place with a strong sense of community. And now those living on Weston's Bourneville estate are using a play written more than 400 years ago to look at the issue of anti-social behaviour and the choices people make. We thought it would be good to um, give people an understanding of what housing estates are, are like. Uh, good ones, bad ones. This one that we're on at the moment is about in between the two actually. It's not too bad, but other times there's bad things that happen on it, like most places. The story of Macbeth may be old, but its themes are still relevant today. It was Macbeth's choices that ultimately led to his downfall. Bad decisions are something Tell knows all too well. I was in the, in the drug scene for a few years. I was around lots of different drugs. Being into this, getting into this drama group, um, it got me out of the drug scene and made me realise that there was a lot more to life than actually sitting around all day taking smoking cannabis. Those who have grown up on the estate say some of its problems stem from boredom amongst the younger generations, a lack of opportunity. It is why school pupils from the neighbouring Hans Price Academy have also got involved. I've always lived there, but it's, everyone says it's like really rough area, and it can be at times, but usually it's, a, it's an all right area, I suppose. It's been a good like sort of twist, like because there's the original like full-on English story, and then there's the new remake, which is more modern and and it's really good. The play, which has been renamed Hurley Burley, is being supported and funded by several local charities. And the director, Angela Athe Hunt, says it offers some a break from the challenges of everyday life. Whether we are being paid to be here, whether we are a director or an assistant director or a producer or a musician, or whether we're a community actor, there's a real sense of equality in the room. And, and that's incredibly important, that we're able to leave our worlds at the door and just celebrate whatever piece of theatre we're working on, really. Shakespeare's play posed a question. Was Macbeth responsible for his downfall, or was it simply the environment he was in? Although this play may have been updated, for those on the Bourneville, the question is the same. John T. Messer, ITV News.